All of my youngest some savages running your trap at you up with them packages. Rob you for bricks, but that shit for pounds. Fuck all that talking, they laying you down. So I just caught wind of a deep dive trailer for Assassin's Creed Valhalla. So let's see the hype. Oh my, that's a nice shot. This is a time of conquest. The age of Vikings. In Assassin's Creed Valhalla, you play as Eivor, the fierce Viking war chief of the Raven Clan. Eivor and their kin have forged into England to settle the new frontiers. But these are dangerous times, and each new landscape contains untold perils and mysteries to uncover. I think I saw that boss in the Your demo. Begins with a a little extra hard. For a home. Your Viking settlement is the beating heart of your adventure, and is the intersecting point oh, for wow, that beautiful. interwoven storylines. Here, you'll get familiar with your clan and begin your journey through England. At the Alliance map, you'll meet Randvi, the clan's key intel gatherer, and plan your first moves. Eivor, Sigurd, I give you England and its four kingdoms. Mercia, East Anglia, Northumbria, and Wessex. By forging alliances with different territories, the Raven Clan will expand their influence allowing you to grow your settlement and open a wealth of new narrative arcs, missions, activities, and ways to experience the game world. Let's go. It's time to okay. capture the kingdom. It's cool. So Each that's how you kingdoms have many stories to uncover. With Get your story power, objectives, casts of characters, and challenges to overcome. Are you Sigurd Dranger? Eivor. If you keep that up, Stay in the floors. Including assassinating targets, forging allies, and assaulting rivals in large scale battles. Oh, can't wait for the raids. That's gonna be the funnest part for me. These story arcs explore the themes of honor, glory, leadership, and choice that are central to Eivor's journey. And your pivotal choices will leave long lasting impacts across the kingdoms. Three men. Three possible futures. Who will serve us best in a time of true need? So it's gonna be lying. Oh my! Um, lying heavily on who I decide to uh, have allegiance with. Thankfully, Eivor is equipped with a diverse set of combat skills, including brute strength charging maneuvers. Dang! Close quarters melee attacks. Oh my! And explosive two-handed finishes. Whoosh. While range abilities. Oh, and you get a dog, Amy. Oh. Allow you to flank and interrupt your foes from a distance. Your skills are upgraded through a progression system, which allows you to unlock perks and abilities to suit your style of play. Special abilities are found in books of knowledge hidden throughout the world, and have their own upgrade tiers that improve their power and effectiveness. As you forge deeper on your journey. That's wrong. Operations will reward you with exotic gear from the far corners of the world. Further unlocking combat options and dual wield combinations, including the legendary Excalibur. Bro, we got Excalibur? Choice is central to Valhalla's player. They should have kept that one a secret. I'll be honest with you. That would have been better off a secret. At the start of your adventure, you'll have the opportunity to choose Eivor's gender. And you can seamlessly swap between male and female Eivor at any time during your story. And so I race my horn to the Raven Clan, the best of friends and fighters. After a victory, you return home with resources pillaged from your conquests, using them to expand your settlement with structures and upgrades. There's a wide variety of structures to build, each with their own unique gameplay systems and perks. The barracks allow you to elect a Jomsviking, which is a powerful Viking lieutenant 
and build a custom crew of raiders to ride with, which are shared with your friends online. Gunnar, the blacksmith, enhances weapons and gear. And at the tattooist, you'll customize Eivor's look. Oh, the shipyard, this is Gudrun, their hair color change. Customize and improve your longship. And oh, that was a solid tattoo, tattoo, too. You will work from the shadows, embroiling yourself in a mysterious conflict with the Order of the Ancients. We have work to do, starting in the cities of England. Our task will not be an easy one. Run that bad. These are just a few examples, and there's plenty more fun to be had around your settlement. Drink your weight in ale, play a game of Orlog, or throw a massive Orlog. Viking feast. However, growth comes with its own set of dangers, and your settlement will become the target of new enemy factions. The septic rot has overtaken this shire. Mm. Yeet! Valhalla's world is built for a wandering spirit. You'll uncover deeper layers to Eivor's own story in a set of dramatic and intimate narrative through lines. I lost my parents when I was nine winters along. Without Sigurd, I would have. There is always one unbreakable bond. Yes. Player choice is woven through every facet of the game experience. And as you continue to explore, you'll uncover new stories and epiphanies in the most unlikely places. Oh, sorry, are you terrorizing somebody? If you seek true understanding. But this world is just the beginning. Valka, the clan seer, will unlock your senses, allowing you to leap beyond. To Asgard, the legendary realm of Norse myth. From Norway to England to new worlds. Assassin's Creed Valhalla allows you to experience your own elemental Viking saga. The thrill of discovery, the glory of victory, and the light of kinship. That's a, another and wedding alliance? Wedding and something? Into the soul of a warrior. Assassin's Creed Valhalla, available November 10th. Bro, oh, I am very stoked for this game so they have combined a lot of elements over uh all the assassin's creed games so they brought them back uh like segment like settlement like uh was assassin's creed 2 um uh, and then kind of and uh what's it called it uh black black uh where you got like a whole little settlement a little town you always go always can go back to upgrade it uh and make it even more uh uh, more important to go back because that's where you get all your missions from your blacksmith, your tattoos, like everything's in the settlement, all in one spot. So, you definitely want to upgrade it. A little incentive, and also, I'm surprised like your man's best friend, the savagery of that wolf by that dude's neck. I didn't expect that, bro. Came out with the savagery. So, I definitely don't get that man's best friend. That, that wolf looked nice. It looks like you get more than one wolf. Uh, customization so one was white like a white wolf one was like a brown wolf i'm definitely going with the white um uh, that looked it raw uh i gotta see the poison uh use the arrow pointing uh hitting chains other stuff in the environment look cool uh brought him back the the hood going in the environment uh like an ac2 ac1 uh it's like a lot of things is this cool man uh bring a lot of good lot of stuff back uh, the violence of it, I'm stoked. Um, I feel like I know a lot of people worry about the these uh, stealth elements. I, I'm not really a stealth person. I usually do like just go straight in. I kind of like mid, uh, half stealth, and what and like twenty percent stealth and eighty percent just go out all uh, violence, uh, uh, straight <laughs> combat. But I just feel like there's a lot of stealth elements in this game that just haven't been shown. Um, uh, I'm surprised they showed this much. So, uh, no, you know, we're gonna go to Asgard. Um, a few stories on the like you see Thor, Odin, all that good stuff. Um, uh, but once we like drugged or just high or whatever, uh, eating mushrooms or whatever they're gonna have us to be doing, uh, to get to that uh fairy, that fairy, uh, that the fairy, uh, 
fantasy point. <laughs> uh, I feel like they're never going to let that go, especially since Origins. Uh, I know it was very heavily in Odyssey, and I know it's not going to be in real world like an, uh, Odyssey was. I had to be uh, under the influence uh, to do all that this stuff. So I can't wait to see the story points for those. Uh, this man is feeling good. Uh, this this game I'm very hyped for. Very hyped for him, bro. Uh, yeah, can't wait for it. Uh, number 10 can come fast enough. But hey, if you like my reaction, give me a like. Want to see more of me? Subscribe to my channel. I'll see you guys next time.